Rivers. Willis is out there with Duncan. Then there's Ginobili. Then it's Tony Parker. And it's Bowen in its small forward. Now here's Rose. Driving inside. And the foul on Derrick Rose. That is his first That's foul his first of the game. Foul. Yeah, really good defensive play to cut him off there and square up. Parker outside. Ginobili outside. Here's Bowen. Willis with a screen on right side. Count it. And though Parker has stretched his game out to the three-point line, he remains at heart a mid-range shooter. Outside Rose. Right side sets the pick for Rose. Drops it in from 14 feet away. And he's not going to miss many of those, especially that wide open. And early on, if you're him, you just want to see the ball go through the net and get into some kind of rhythm. Here's Bowen. Duncan with a screen on Levine. Picks it out to Ginobili. Shot clock at six. The Spurs need to get a shot off here. Willis, no good. All right, let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Alder. Thanks, Kevin. Greg Popovich and I did speak a few minutes ago. Coach was saying that he feels Zach Levine is still underrated as a star in this thing. Coach said, when Levine gets going, there's just no way to stop him. He's one of the most natural scoring threats in the league. They certainly will respect Levine's explosive offense tonight. Guys? Thank you, David. Those are chances. Almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of rhythm. Here in the first quarter with about two minutes gone by. Here's Henry, covered by Parker. Here's Rose. Right side trying to break free. Rose, that's good. Rose has got six. This is why Derrick Rose is considered one of the best at his position. He is not afraid of going down low. Parker outside. Ginobili with the ball. Now defended by Adebayo. Ginobili the pass to Willis. Shoots over to Henry. Count it. Good. I mean, every time down the floor, this is what you're trying to do. Find the right matchup. Outside Rose. We're about three minutes into this first quarter. There's the drive. And Rose throws it down hard. Incredible. D. Rose deal with great. He left. He breaks out a dump. He's probably been working on for a while. All right, look who's coming up. And the Spurs with possession. Trailing by four. Give him a hand. Rose against Parker. Your lovable dance team. Duncan inside. And no good. Good work defensively by Whiteside. There's Levine. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle. And now a three-point play chance here for him. And this has been a great job of just getting into the middle of that defense and really scoring effectively from the paint. Bulls shoot their first free throw of the game right now. At the line for the Bulls, Zach Levine. When it comes to scoring, Zach Levine is just getting better and better. Every season, he comes back a stronger shooter. Now here's Ginobili. No points in the game yet for him. To the inside. And it's Mono Ginobili with Mano the finish. Ginobili. Never a bad idea to run the old pick play. Uh-uh, you're right. And if it produces a slam like that, we'll probably see more of them. Especially if the defense is going to allow you to do it. 
have to switch on that play. And here are the Bulls now. After the basket by San Antonio, Levine's shot is off. I mean, you won't see this too often. Getting denied at the rim. He's likely to remember that one. To the right side. Dermanenko down low. He's covered by Whiteside. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Yeah, the defender all over. First team foul. San Antonio shooting their first free throws of the game. San Antonio. At the line for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he makes the first. He's perfect from the line this time. And so it's Rose who brings the ball up for the Bulls. It's a three-point game. Outside, Levine fires the three. No good that time. And it's the Spurs taking it the other way. Parker looking over the floor. Ginobili outside. Duncan with the screen for Ginobili. Over Rose. The jumper from the free throw line is good. Ginobili's got his second basket. Yeah, in that mid-range game of Ginobili, so reliable, he is phenomenal at capitalizing from those spots on the floor. Passes to Henry. Ginobili with the steal. Pass to Bowen. Here's the three. Offensive rebound. Goes back up. Ginobili misses. Here's Henry, covered by Parker. Pass to Autobio. Back to Levine. Six to shoot over Ginobili. That one's not going to go. And San Antonio will go the other way with it. Termenenko with it. The pass to Bowen. From the arc. It's Autobio with the rebound. Chicago leading. Passes it to Rose. Back to Levine. Kicks it to Rose. On deep. And the shot clock expires. 24 second violation. Spurs ball. Here's San Antonio. Ginobili outside. And it's good on the assist by Parker. Ginobili's got six Tony points. Parker. The veteran eyes see all. Frenchy with a tremendous look to make that play happen. Levine finds Rose. Back to Levine. Trying to end the drought. And the layup is up and in. Five points in the game. Great court awareness by Derrick Rose. Reading every inch of the floor so well. Pass to Ginobili. To the paint. And that one's good, Duncan. And the Spurs lead by one. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Get up and get loud for the Lovable. Give them a hand, fans. Your Lovable. On defense, the Spurs. Al Levine. He's got five. Left side, Curry. A second chance effort. Here's Gafford. 
just couldn't take the lid off. They had their chances, but came up empty. Pass to Barry. Ginobili outside from outside the arc. Chicago grabs the miss. They couldn't put the pieces together, losing the last matchup with the Lakers. Yeah, a snowball effect in that one. One thing would go wrong, but then another, then another. Really, the story of the game. I was surprised they put up so little fight. That was not the team I expected to see that night. Now, here's Baylor. Back to Ginobili. The pass to Willis. Just five on the clock. Grant finds Ginobili. Hits it from three-point range. Ginobili. Now it's a four-point Spurs lead. A jack of all trades. Jeremy Grant also has a strong feel for when his guys are uncovered. Levine, and he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. And the foul goes against San Antonio. And, and a chance to catch up on some numbers here. The scoring breakdown for San Antonio. Their passing has been excellent here early. A lot of their baskets coming off an insist. That should set a great tone for the rest of the game. And also, it's been a positive to watch that they've attacked the paint offensively as well. It's really been about the balance that they've shown. And the first one drops. And so Levine nails both of them. And so it's San Antonio with it. Ginobili looking around. Here's Barry. A three-pointer off the mark. Chicago trailing here. Steps back. And here is Curry. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Levine against Ginobili. Levine can't hit. No doubt it's been a bit of a struggle for him here in this quarter in terms of scoring. Ginobili the pass to Barry. Back to Ginobili. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. It's on Zach Levine. And I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now. Two shots. Shooting two. The first free throw is good. Good on the second, so he makes them both. And it's the Bulls with the ball. Trailing by four. And Levine, here we go. And Levine throws it down. A burst of speed from Levine. He's so tenacious and clever on the drive. Ginobili the pass to Barrett. Willis with a screen on Kirk. Tries again. And the layup is good. Kevin Willis. And the Spurs lead by four. Hustle points count just like any others. That's a great play. Chicago, Chicago calls timeout. It's time for Easter. All right, this is coming out of the court. Get up and get loud for the lovable. Give them a hand, fans. Your Lovables dance team. Payne passes to Levine. Gafford with the ball. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Yeah, clearly he hadn't established the position there. 13 foul. Levine finishes the curve. The From the top of the key, he's now one for two with that bucket. Now that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. 
The Bulls making a switch here. Ion's checked in. Spurs also with the sub. Mills is checked in. Passes it to Barry. Willis with it. Shoots over Vucevic. Again, the miss by the Spurs. 143 left here in the first quarter. Here's Bain. No good. That would have tied it. And it's Mills with the ball for San Antonio. Baylor kicks to Mills. Here's Willis. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Willis. Willis has got his third basket of the night right there. And they've done well at taking advantage of some late defensive rotations and getting the ball in the paint. Here's Curry with the three. Oh, drew the foul and almost hit the three-point bucket. But he'll go to the line to shoot three. First personal foul. Yeah, you, you hate to give up a foul on a three-point attempt. For Chicago, they have yet to miss from the free throw line. They're three for three. And really, they haven't been able to differentiate themselves from the free throw line on the season at about 76%. And he hits the first of three. And the second free throw, good. And he makes all three. Here's Mills. Pass to Willis. Shoots over Vucevic, and Willis gets it to go. Willis has got eight. I tell you what, it's, it's almost like stealing to watch how he plays the game from this scene. It's Curry with the drive, and that one good. Curry for interior defense. If you play him soft, he's going to kill you. Here's Barry. He's still scoreless so far in this one. And here's Mills for three. That one's off. He starts the game with a miss. About three seconds between shot and game clock. Up job, Gafford. To the left side wing. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Bain. And he uses the glass on the way. And the Bulls lead by one. And when you're a high usage player like Vucevic, you have to keep your head up and be willing to make the next pass. And so with Zach Levine making things happen for Chicago. He finishes with nine points in the Just tuning in, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. All right, we'll take a look now at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for Chicago. Guys, their willingness to attack the basket so far has been great. They're penetrating, find the holes in the defense, and scoring from close range. And they're also clicking at the free throw line, not wasting any of those opportunities. So with Ginobili on the bench, here's how the floor looks for Greg Popovich. Grant is out there with Baylor. Then it's Mills. Then there's Kevin Willis. And it's Barry in at the shooting guard. Here's Ion. Rebound San Antonio. Willis has got five rebounds tonight. Here's Barry. Outs one up. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Daniel Gafford. Yeah, easy call. That's his first personal foul. San Antonio shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. Shooting for San Antonio. 
Brent Berry taking two shots. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. The first one falls. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. Bulls trail by three. Here's Ion. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Vucevic setting the pick for Curry. Into the lane. And that's collected by Willis. Willis has got six rebounds in the game. And there's the pass to Barry. Inside. And Willis gets it to go. Willis has got the lead up to five now for San Antonio. They've settled into a nice groove offensively here in the second. It's Teacher Bonanza. Make the noise. Chicago making some changes. Adebayo is checked in for Daniel Gafford. And it's Rose in for Curry. San Antonio also making some changes. Duncan, he's checked in for Jeremy Grant. And Parker subbed in for Patty Mills. Bain passes to Rose. Over Baylor. And again, Chicago. No good. San Antonio leading by five. Now here's Parker. Passes it to Barry. Willis with it. He's guarded by Adebayo. Fades and shoots. And misses it off the right side of the rim. Can't fault the play call, even though he could convert. That's a good shot. Put that bucket in in no time at all. Ion's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. Rose against Parker. Here's Duncan. Makes it off the glass. Tim Duncan. And the Spurs lead by four. And Duncan just superb when he gets in close to the basket. Has a number of moves to choose from. And that soft, delicate touch near the rim. They get it back. Here's Rose. Bank shot. No good. The defense did a really good job of choking off the middle there once he got inside. Pass to Barry. Duncan down low. High to bio on him. Beasting on defense. First he closes out hard on the shooter. Then he attacks the glass. Filthy. Here's Ion and Baylor with the block. Something that's kept this game close is the fact that the rebound stats for both teams are almost identical. Here's Parker. Willis down low. Goes back up. And he lays it up and in. Willis. Willis has got 12 points in the game. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Rose passes to Ion. Back to Rose. Out to the wing. Let's it go with a three. Ion, no luck. San Antonio leading by six. And just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Pass to Willis. Parker outside. A shot off that time. Great D that time from Autobio. Bain passes to Autobio. And Ion kicks to Rose. There's the pass to Ion. Back to Rose. Down through the hoop it goes. That's his fifth make on nine shots from the floor. And they've repeatedly probed inside in the first. Tag, guys, and, and it's paid off with the time. All right, Nikus coming out of the court. Get up and get down. A different look now for San Antonio. 
Bowens checked in, and it's Shinobi in for a bear. That was your lovable state team. Make some noise. Shinobi outside. Back to Parker. Duncan with his screen on Rose. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Hassan White. They get Hassan White son. Always looking for a way to create an opportunity. Parker catches the defender off balance. This is his first free throw of the game. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. And they have yet to miss a shot from the line here this quarter. Second free throw, no good. Popovich has done a great job of developing Tony Parker's entire game, and you're seeing it right now at the free throw line. And for his offense, this has just been a brutal period. Down low, Dermanenko. That shot's good on the assist by Ginobili. Ginobili's got three assists tonight. And not hard to see why they are giving up points on this one. Just too many good looks from in close. Right side sets the pick for Rhodes. Oh, and the jam by Rhodes. That's what you love about him. Once he drives the basketball, he has the ability to finish with the dunk. Pass to Parker. Now Duncan. Over Whiteside. No good from Duncan. No other way to put it. Just a poor shooting performance for him. But luckily, his teammates have picked up the slack. Now here's Rose. Guarded close. Feeds it to Whiteside. Down to five on the shot clock. Nice D from Duncan. San Antonio leading by five. Here's Bowen. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Pass to Parker. Duncan with the screen for Parker. Here's Bowen. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Autobio has got seven rebounds in the game. And the ball travels out of bounds. It was last touched by Rose. And this is what the schedule looks like for the Spurs. On Monday, they'll tip off a homestand, starting with the Brooklyn Nets. And then on Wednesday, they'll host the Boston Celtics. And if I'm this team, I'm looking at this as a barometer to see how we stack up against some of the top teams in the league. They'll have to be at their best. But if they come out of this with some success, I think it'll build momentum for the rest of the run. Bulls trail by five. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Here's Ginobili. Here's Duncan. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Yeah, the quiet intensity that Duncan brings, just incredible. He's a consistent force whose teammates really look up to. At the line for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. No good on the free throw. And he's good on the second. Bulls trail by six. Now Levine. He's got nine. Outside Rose. Autobio the screen. Puts up a three. And it's Rose missing. 
And here is Ginobili. He's got 11. Pass to Parker. Back to Ginobili. Lock at six. Duncan with the screen for Ginobili. And out of Bayer who sends it back. This shot can't get past Bam. His reach is just too much. Doing his job on the glass and doing it with force. And Greg, it's not everybody in the league who can make those kinds of plays. You know, this is one of his specialties, keeping plays alive, creating second chance opportunities. Now here's Rose. Defense right on him. Levine wide open. Yes, and it's Rose with the assist that time. Levine's got 12 in the game. Takes a step back. Ginobili outside. Duncan with the screen for Ginobili. And Whiteside sends it back. Whiteside gives enough space, waits, elevates. Quality block shot by the big fella. Now the pass to Levine. Here's Otobio. Hits the jump hook. Now it's just a three-point San Antonio lead. Attacking the defense with the pass. Don't need to be a hero. Parker left side. Nice shot from the wing. Tony Parker. Parker's got his second bucket. Well time play. Parker sets up ready to catch and fire. And the pass is on point. Rose finds Autobio. That's basket number two with his third shot off to a fast two for three. Great job of screening. There, nice job to take it to the rim and get the finish. Passes it to Parker. Back to Ginobili. That shot off. Great D that time from Adebayo. Rose gets a wide open look. And the Bulls, another three. Oh, great ball movement there. Ginobili outside. Parker dishes to Ginobili. Back to Parker. That falls nice feed that time for Mano Ginobili. Ginobili's got his fifth assist in this one. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Levine deciding where to go with it. Pass to Rhodes. Driving to the basket. And Rhodes throws it down hard. The defense is in trouble because off the pick and roll, he uses his speed, he can knock down the shot, and he has a flow. Pass to Parker. Looking for Ginobili, he gets it there. It's good. Ginobili's got 13 points. And boy, he's really in a groove. Dominant performance last game. Same thing this time out. Here's the thing. He's a guy who will go on hot streaks for you over a number of games. Here's Adebayo. From down in the low post, it goes. Adebayo's got it all tied up now for the Bulls. Parker against Rose. 51 seconds left here in the second. Ginobili draws the double. Duncan, the pass to Bowen. And Whiteside sends it back. Rose with the ball. Right wing. To the middle. Right side, high post. Duncan is there. Levine passes to Rose. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. And the pass to Bowen. To the inside. Here's Duncan. Stolen by Levine. What a performance for Derrick Rose. He has been the story for the Bulls.